What did you say? I wasn't sure what to say. I told him that I loved him. And I promised him that I wasn't going anywhere. But? One of the first things they teach you on the job is to never make a promise you're not sure you can keep. You were trying to reassure your son, who's already lost one parent, that he's not about to lose another. Bullets don't bounce off me, Carla. I learned that the hard way. You still thinking about that? No, and then. Like when I get taken hostage at gunpoint. You what? Happened a few weeks back. Buck and I got caught up in a prison escape. Neither of us got hurt, so I didn't see a point in telling you or him. But it did remind me that what I do is not without risk. Okay, I can't lie. I wish your biggest danger at work was you getting a paper cut. But I know that your job is important, not just to the people you save, but to you. But is it more important than my kid feeling safe when he closes his eyes at night? 911, what's your emergency? The wall is gone! You gotta help us, please! My husband's in there, we can't get to him! Okay, everybody step back! Okay, it looks like you hit this post and took some of the structure down with it. I don't understand how this happened. We were on the phone arguing over the Christmas tree, and then all of a sudden this comes crashing down. You said you were on the phone with him? Yes. Has he said anything since the collapse? No. <laughs> he just stopped talking. Okay, Buck, Eddie, Han, I want you to start clearing this debris carefully. Everybody else, step back and give us some room to work. What do you need me, Kath? I need you evacuating this building. I'm concerned it's going to come crashing down any minute. These structures are supposed to be retrofitted after the Northridge quake, but from the looks of things, landlord didn't get around to it. Do the residents know that? They're about to find out. <laughs> Cap, he's unconscious, possibly not breathing. Is he dead? Is Dad dead? Come here, sweetie. They're gonna get him. Airbag is in place. Okay, let's lift it nice and slow. We need just enough space between the car and the ceiling to pop that door and pull them out. Okay, that should do it. Eddie, go. Cap, he's coming around. Okay, that's good news. Let's get a collar on him and put him on a board. All right, bud. That's good. You got him? Got you. Let's get him on the gurney. Slowly, slowly. Keep him stable. Watch the neck. Pressure slightly elevated, probably from the pain, but we can't rule out internal injuries. Let's start a line. Wash his legs. 